Every other year, the U.S. military gathers forces in Honolulu to practice for war in the Pacific. The exercise will feature a formation of entirely uncrewed robot boats. The newly created Unmanned Surface Vessel Division 1, or USVDIV-1, will let the Navy and the rest of the military practice how to fight war with and alongside giant sea drones. As the military rehearses for a potential future war, it will do so alongside a wholly new category of machine. The Rim of the Pacific exercise run from Honolulu, or RIMPAC, has long been a testing ground for new concepts. As commanders and troops work alongside new machines to see if they will work as planned in simulated combat environments. Sea Hunter and Sea Hawk will be used similarly. With sensors used to extend the range of perception for existing weapons based on other vehicles. One merit of uncrewed vehicles is that they can extend the perception of the rest of the fleet without similarly extending. The vulnerability of sailors in the same way as a crewed and inhabited vessel. The uncrewed ships will allow the Navy to explore how it uses the ships, and even more than that, give commanders an opportunity in the field to see what more such vehicles could potentially bring. In the RIMPAC exercise, the Navy will be able to see if the robot ships it has on hand offer a promise of the future it wants to work towards, or if the whole vision for robots and humans fighting alongside each other at sea needs to be rethought. Ultimately, the Navy's planned method for fighting future wars at sea is by bringing more missiles to the fight and making sure those missiles hit targets accurately.